Hi, yeah, boys, guys, welcome back, man, to the channel. <sighs> welcome back, man, again to the series, man. F1 2020, my team career mode. Still a very same guy. I'm going to say, hello, I'm going to say, okay, okay, I'm going to say, okay, I'm going to say, okay, I'm going to this part, and thank you guys so much for support, man, remind out to me. So, yeah, I'm, I'm taking you guys to the HQ. Um, it was just like, I can race a goal uh, that where Charles, our teammate, firstly won. Uh, he's, I'll say that yeah, he won his first uh, race with the team. I'm really excited. I know he was capable of winning. It's just like I had to let, let off there and then yeah, just give him victory, man. Cause I wanted to do this in Azerbaijan, but he was, he lost some positions there and there, so I couldn't risk it. And then in Monaco, I didn't think of it, so I should have done it in Monaco. Cash sitting around doing nothing. We should start investing that in facility improvements. Solid. So yeah, I'm just going to go through almost everything, and I'm just I'm just going to uh, run down quickly, and then I'm going to pick the sponsors by myself, and then I'll show you guys the sponsors that I, that I already picked. So yeah, but I'm really excited, man. Like I'm not gonna lie, uh, like the team is doing very very well. We are managing everything. We are performing to our alternate best at this point. So. Just give me one second and then I'm going to choose my sponsors and then I'll show you guys what I have. One second. So yeah guys, this is what I end up with. Ah, not fancy. It's just simple and straightforward. Um, and remember that I'm going to be practicing now, so I have to use... Ah, the energy store though. So the, the penalties. Uh, when do I not get a penalty? I'm still not sure about that specific part, but yeah, I don't know. Cool. I have 1.88. Whoa, this one is huge, but I feel like my gear boss can last six races, so I'm not really worried about it for now. So mm, this one is fine. I think it's the reason why also one why we are like destroying everyone on track really um this is where i want to invest my money on because okay you know what i'm gonna save i'm not gonna rush at this point i have 25 million and let me see okay see now i have to negotiate with charles leclerc there's no way i'm not going to negotiate with him um yeah, let me approach him and see what he wants. I'm um, gonna say low risk. 9.4 million. Confirm, take him. Yeah, like he deserves more because he won us a Grand Prix. Like, you know what that means, dude. Like, yeah. So, since it's midway through the season, um,. Let me check something here real quick. Since it's midway, um, how, so how much I have left? I have 16 million even after I signed the Charles. So let me see what I can. Yeah, I slightly improve his pace. I want his pace to be there. Yeah. Investing on that. Nothing really like much I can do at this point because I already like have everything I need so so I'm actually having six six seven million you know what I'm gonna invest here because because I, I really like, achieved my goal uh, for now so uh, all right cool um hmm it is time to change the car yes you guys had me right. It's time now to change the car. Uh, I have to change the livery. But I might turn it three times this time around. But I'm just going to turn it up because it's halfway through the season. You guys know me. I always change it after the, the half mark of the season. So, yeah. Let me do my thing and then I'll show you guys the final product. Yeah, just give me one second and then, yeah, I'll show you. Here we go. Yep, like the car is done, but uh, I first wanted to, sh to show you like, uh, uh, so I changed just a little bit, like it's my helmet, my gloves, just a little bit. I didn't go crazy because I, I know 
I am still working on my, I think it's my podium pass. So once I unlock some stuff, and then uh, that's when you guys will see the great um, setup that I actually end up with. So for now, I just took like, this basic one. Now, this is going to be a livery for our next few races. Uh, it is basic and I like the message on it because it says end racism. Like this is a big topic, um, so if, it, if also you, me using my platform to just spread the message, then I will use it man. So yeah, this is what I end up with, uh, looks nice, uh, pretty, pretty straightforward, but I, I love it because like, at least whenever I race, I will be reminded uh, that whatever we do, uh, we have to, we have to basically give each other space and we have to accommodate each other. So yeah. Uh, that's that's the new car. Uh, that is Charles, and he just had a couple of you know. I'll just say he's he's a little bit richer, so to speak. But that's not my concern at this point because I know he's performing. Uh, he's really helping the team. He's really helping me. Uh, so yeah, uh, I think. Oh yeah, let's go to the activities. All right, cool. Durability. Hmm. Nope. Team building. I'll, I'll go for this, and then. Um, a sport event, no, like these ones are not necessary for me, uh, no, shetty, hmm, yeah, shetty, I'll take it, um, durability, no, race experience, yeah, I'll take that, so yeah, I'm, I'm happy with this, the way I end up with, and yeah, I think I've been here too much now, and as you guys can see, also on the wall, it says we race as one, we do not have enough guys to afford, no, yeah, yeah, I know, but I just renewed him, so he's not gonna have a problem for now. So, guys, let's do it. Uh, I'm really excited, man. I'm really happy. Um, everything turned out our way. We paid for for Charles's new contract, and we also have new sponsors. And okay, we've had the new parts come through from the fabrication process. We'll have them with us for the next Grand Prix. Nice. Right. So, uh, I just wanna see how does this thing looks like now. Okay. So cool. Spec 2, I'm really excited. That was that was an investment then there, but you can see it also changed. Uh, so Charles is yeah, he's having a nice setup there. Um, and also, yeah, I'm really happy with this. I'm really excited. So, but yeah, other than that, nothing else crazy. So I have to go to the weekend. Let's go to the weekend, guys, and I'll catch you guys uh, on the garage in a second. Alright, so here we are guys, and once again, like, yeah, the weekend looks amazing, uh, we should be okay, uh, through qualifying and also race, I'm really excited about that, um, I'm not going to waste my R&Ds for now, I just want to save them, because, like, the car is still performing very, very well, um, the only thing that I'm thinking is just, like, energy store, hmm, I'm thinking about it, thinking, not sure, I'm not saying I will do it, but, I'm just thinking, I'm just thinking because I might need it, the turbo, okay cool, I'm just gonna save, I'm gonna save it, and then I also want to see if like they'll change the regulations as well, so yeah, I have to keep that in mind, so yeah, we are five races in, uh, and gearbox still looking very, very, yeah, still looking solid, uh, 40%, and I'm already five, so which means I might, let's, let's see the first one, the first one was, it was 70%, and then I changed it, so I think I'll play, Roughly two, two, two or three races more, and then yeah, the gearbox will be, yeah, will complain. But I'm not really concerned about that. The only thing I'm concerned about is the power unit. I think I might have to take a great penalty pretty soon. Um, I thought maybe halfway through the season you can change, but it seems like I was wrong. My estimation were wrong, but yeah, I'm not, I'm not hurt about it, and I know I'm going to perform very, very well through the qualifying so guys give me one second i'm just going to finish my practice one and two i don't i don't do practice three and then i'll just cut you guys to qualifying in a second here we go i recommend we could go for something like this
Fantastic. That was the fastest lap. Our best lap so far is a 126.0. Fastest lap? Good job. If you want to know specific information or make certain changes to the car during a pit stop, you can tell me what you want over the radio. Press and hold the radio button to activate the system, and you can either speak the command...
That's the fastest lap so far. Well done. Put in the fastest lap. Good job. And with qualifying complete, let's review our top three today. Morgan, Hamilton and Valtteri Bottas. Goodbye for now then, but we're really just getting started. Make sure to join us again for Lights Out tomorrow. Yeah, so obviously not my best qualifying uh, performance. Uh, for some reason, I don't know why I couldn't match my Q2 pace. Because my Q2, I actually got 1 minute 25.1. So this time around, I was just struggling to get, like, I don't know, the car up to speed. So 
But I'll, I'll take pole even though I was not expecting pole. I was expecting him to be at least um, third or fourth on that one. But yeah, other than that, nah, man, I, f I feel comfortable and mm, uh, not 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 my typical setup because I'm not going to be racing uh, using my strategy. Fans really seem to enjoy that. It made it look easy. Great qualifying session. Are you feeling safer ahead of the pack? Um, let me see. Yeah, I'll just say this, yeah. Are you happy with where you'll be on the grid tomorrow? Yes, I am. Um... Okay. Appreciate your time. No problem. So guys, I was still saying, man, um... I feel like I was too quick on Q2. And I tried to basically go with, uh... the. The, the medium tires and then I came back and I put the soft tires because I saw I think it was Lewis uh, was on the medium so I, I always like to do uh, the different strategy as like the guy that I'm really racing or my competitor that at the time so that's the reason why I came in and then I chose to change the tires and then I put like um I would say I then put the soft tires and yeah but it's going to be different and it's going to be a little bit difficult because I have to start on the soft tires like I like to start on the medium tires because I know I will be a little bit slower and then once I get to the, the, to, to the soft then I will be quicker but this time around it's a different case and I have to make use of this strategy and make it work because the only threat at this point it will be Valtteri I mean like it will be Lewis but uh, Valtteri also qualified on medium so I mean the soft so I may have to Undercut or so everybody else to see. I'm not. I'm not really sure, but it should give me an advantage for the race. Right. I think we can call that a successful qualifying. We should be in with a good chance in the race. Yeah, I must say, like I felt quick uh, through qualifying, but uh, other than that, no, I uh, just don't feel the track. I may have to take a penalty for this for the next race. I'll say, but yeah, I should see. Uh, I don't want to talk for now. But if I take a penalty, then I would have to be back on the grid. It will be hungry though. And then I have to basically work, work, walk my way up to yeah to the end. So guys, thank you so much for watching this part. Now remember to me, man, still the very same guy. I'm content to on board. Okay, all the access is for guys. I like I've been. I'm proud to see you guys on the front chairs. I'm signing out right now. Catch you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out of here. Peace.